But um, I just want to caution John, Jonathan on this because let me tell you something, Jonathan. Few people, a few men that I know, value anything more than their own families. And when you become a stumbling block to the growth of their family and the health of their family, you're putting yourself in harm's way. Now, I'm not advocating any type of violence or harm come to you, but I know a lot of guys that wouldn't tolerate it. So you need to be very careful what you're doing. Hey, YouTube. Hopefully I can get through this. I start off going to do a totally different video, and in the course of the research, I stumbled across something that I felt like needed to be addressed. I apologize for the road noise. I apologize for any other distractions. Um, hopefully my mouse is going to work. Um, I'm low on RAM and I uh, had to reinstall my uh, my video program here. But uh, the first comment on this video, uh, number four, case closed. The jury can make its decision. Can now make its decision. Um, comment by this Tina Attaway. Great video, Jonathan. However, I am ready for the do-rag. I have been following you since July 2016 when I was led to you, so I'm sure you get it. So sad, though, that I can no longer show anything to my husband without causing him to go crazy. Crazy or ha-ha-ha. That is so disrespectful, I can't even believe it. And not only that, but then she gets 22 thumbs up and she gets all these attaboys from all these other cult followers of Click. And so I just want to go over a couple of scriptures here. I'm going to try to make this brief and uh, make my other video when things are a little bit more favorable for that. Um, but here we go, if I can get my mouse to move. There's a hundred Bible verses that talks about the wife should be submissive to the husband, not doing things behind his back, not mocking him, not insulting him. Um, here's one case in point. Wives, submit yourselves to your own husbands as unto the Lord. Okay? Okay, here's a comment. Submission of wives to husbands. Uh, focus on the family. The submission of the wife to the husband within the marital bond. Ephesians 5.22 is the best explained from um, two different but exemplary points of view. The spiritual significance of the marriage. Ephesians 5.32 and the inherent difference between males and females. Okay, here's an actual scripture that he's talking about. Um, does a wife have to submit to her husband? Got questions. Dot org. Here is the plain biblical command. Wives, submit yourselves to your own husbands as you do to the Lord. When the husband is the head of the wife, as Christ is the head of the church, his body, of which he is Savior. Now as the church submits to Christ, so also wives should submit to their husbands in everything, Ephesians 5, 22, 24, okay? So, you know, scripture says that people that don't take um, chastisement, it talks specifically about men that don't take chastisement, which I'm sure this Tina probably won't, but um, it says that um, but if ye be without chastisement, whereof all ye are partakers, then ye are bastards and not sons. What does that make the female? Bitches, maybe? Just saying. So, um, you know, you guys can decide that on your own. But this is a short, sweet, not so sweet video, but um, I just want to caution John, Jonathan on this because let me tell you something, Jonathan. Few people, a few men that I know, value anything more than their own families. And when you become a stumbling block to the growth of their family and the health of their family, you're putting yourself in harm's way. Now, I'm not advocating any type of violence or harm come to you. But I know a lot of guys that wouldn't tolerate it. So you need to be very careful what you're doing. I notice here in the comments, 
that you did not correct her at all. Some prophet of God you are, okay? Because if you were worth your salt as a spiritual leader, you would have chastised her a little bit and told her, hey, no, you need to be listening to your husband. But you didn't do that. So basically you're complicit in her undermining her own family and her husband. Think about that, Jonathan. Some guys might not take that as being uh, a good thing. They might act on it. So be careful. <laughs>